Hey, what's up? It's KB here. Check this out. I'm playing a game, so I need to talk to my friend in Discord without leaving the game, without minimizing it or anything like that. I'm gonna press Windows plus G key, and you can see I have a Discord here. There is a icon Discord. I can click on it, and here I have the Discord without leaving the game. If I click anywhere else on the screen beside uh, on the widget itself or uh, the game bar, just like that it disappears again i can appear and type it in here while playing the game game will still run in background because as you know xbox game bar for windows uh, is like a overlay and now we have widgets that we can add and today we're gonna talk about the discord widget yeah look at me i can chat with my friend without leaving the game without minimizing it or no nothing like that so yeah, there are other widgets too, but we're just going to talk about the Discord because this is the most important stuff <laughs> when it comes to gaming and when it comes to talking to your friend. Okay, how to get the Discord for Game Bar? Actually, go to Microsoft Store from there, search for Discord for Game Bar, just like that. And it's in Alpha, it's not in even in Beta, so expect some weird bugs. I'll tell you the bug, the biggest bug that it has right now but it works somehow so this is uh pretty cool i mean just look at me i'm doing uh, you know windows plus g and i have the discord widget here if you don't see this go to widgets and from there you can start them okay whatever widget you want to see here you can see i have the discord start here if i unstart it it's gonna disappear if i start it it's gonna come back here uh, I know if you're a gamer, uh, you're going to be very happy to use this feature because this thing acts as a overlay on top of whatever you're doing in the background without interrupting your work, your gameplay or whatever you're trying to do. So it's it's really, really cool. Now, actually, let me show you guys uh, the bug. What the bug is, uh, you can open Discord for Game Bar as a regular app too. But the problem is that sometimes you may have to log in again. Uh, for some reason, it logs you out. Uh, as I said, this is in alpha, alpha build. So it's like super, super early build of Discord for Game Bar. So expect some bugs. Yeah, you may have to sign in again and again when you open this for the first time. Or what you can do is open this app in normal way, sign in, if just in case it has signed you out, and keep it and open this thing in background. And then open this, uh, and your game bar should work. But still, I don't know. It's it's working right now. It wasn't working earlier. Let me try this. Yeah, you can see I closed the actual desktop app now the widget is not working so let me try this one more time uh, now it's working <laughs> okay this thing is in alpha all right it's like super early build which means very unstable so things might not work as you expect so i'm pretty sure it will get better in beta and final builds but even in alpha it's it's working right so yeah no complaints yeah, sometime you may have to sign in again, but right now it looks like like it's working flawlessly. So yeah, that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. If you still have any questions or have any suggestions for me, you can always do the comment and we can have some chit chat in the comments too. Discord for Game Bar is actually game changer uh, because if you're someone who plays games and use Discord at the same time, this is going to change your life. I don't think I need to talk too much. You understand why and how. So that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye-bye.